Hi, welcome to Nepal Digital Education. Today in this video, we are going to start the numericals of work energy and power of class 9. These all numerical problems taken from Reliant Publication or Reliant Science. Let us look at the problem first. A body of 40 kg mass is taken to a height of 5 meter. What is the work done? First of all, we have to understand about work. So, we know that work equal to force into displacement. We can also say work equal to force into direction, distance in the direction of force applied. There are two types of the work. First one is work done against gravity. Work done against gravity. In gravity, we use work equal to force into distance in the direction of force applied this distance means displacement and we use force equal to mass into acceleration due to gravity and this is distance but second type is work against friction friction in this we use work equal to F into D and F force is given by M into A D. Here A is acceleration but in this there is G acceleration due to gravity. So before solving numerical problem there is three steps. First step is first of all write the given and second step is you have to convert the given into SI system then third step is you have to apply the formula so let us look at the problem first a body of 40 kg mass is taken to a height of 5 meter what is the work done and g is given 10 meter per square second so first of all write the given given your mass is mass is 40 kg taken to a height of 5 meter so height is given height is given 5 meter height means distance distance what is the work done it is work done against gravity because a body of 40 kg mass taken to a height taken to a height so in case of height no in case of height we use work done against gravity work done against gravity so we know that work done is f into d d is displacement or we can also say distance in the direction of force applied so force mg in case of height or gravity d then mass is given 40 and g is given 10 g is given 10 meter per square second here g is given 10 meter per square second so here m become 40 g become 10 and distance is given 5 here distance is given 5 so by solving it uh, 5 for the 20 and double zero and and this is the work and what is the unit of work joule so this is the required work done that is 2000 joule let us look at the problem second the work done on the body of mass 10 kg to lift it through a certain height is 490 joule calculate the height through which the body is lifted and the value of g is given 9.8 meter per square second so in this problem work done on the body of mass mass is given 10 kg so first of all write the given mass is given 10 kg 
to to lift it to a certain height it is also case of height so we use work done against gravity 490 joule joule the uni, uh, what is the unit of work joule so it is what it is given work work is given 490 joule calculate the height we have to find the height or we can say distance through which the body is lifted and g is given g is given 9.8 meter per square second we know that work done against gravity is given by f into d f m g d then what is the value of m 10 and g is given 9.8 and d is given we have to find the d but here w is given w is given 490 so 490 490 it is in multiplication so it comes in division d when we solve it then we get d5 the value become 5 and what is the unit of distance or height meter so this is the required height required height through which body is lifted that is 5 meter this is the required height 5 meter so let us look at the next problem problem number 3 in this problem a crane can lift a load of 200 newton to a height of 5 meter in 10 seconds calculate the power of the crane in this problem we have to find the power of the crane but first of all before solving we have to write the given so here a crane can lift a load of this much load means this is given load load or we can also say this is force force to a height of height is given height or we can say distance no height 5 meter in 10 second 10 second time is given 10 second calculate the power of the crane power we have to find the power we know that power is given by work done upon time taken and work done work done means f into d by t and what is the force force is given 200 so force is 200 and distance or height height is what 5 and time is given 10 so solve it 5 to the 10 and if 2 2 cancel 2 1 0 2 and 0 0 and this is the required answer and power what is the unit of power watt so this is the required power of the crane that is 100 watt